The Sheriff's Office and other police agencies conduct thousands of traffic stops every year. Each time we do, we have to consider our own safety and yours. That's why it's especially important that we educate you regarding the proper process for responding to a traffic stop. Washington traffic law requires that all drivers yield the right of way to emergency vehicles. Drivers are to immediately pull over parallel to the right-hand edge of the road, stop, and remain in position until the emergency vehicle has passed. If you see a police vehicle approaching you in your rearview mirror with lights activated, please keep in mind that there are many different reasons why you might be stopped. You may be stopped because you have committed a traffic violation, you fit the description of a suspect, or perhaps you've witnessed a crime. It's also possible that the officer thinks you're in trouble, need help, or are otherwise at risk. Whatever the reason, the officers need your cooperation to safely make the traffic stop. If you are stopped by the police while driving, you may feel confused, anxious, or even angry. These are common feelings, but remember, traffic stops are stressful and dangerous for the police officer. Each year, many police officers are killed or seriously injured while making routine traffic stops. After you have safely stopped, the officer will approach your car and inform you of the reason for the stop. Stay in your car unless the officer directs you to get out. Keep your hands on the steering wheel so the officer can see them. You should avoid any sudden movements, especially toward the floorboard, rear seat, or passenger side of the vehicle. Morning, sir. You know why I pulled you over? No, no. What happened? You failed to stop at that stop sign back there. Did you see that? I didn't. I'm sorry. Okay. You need to come to a full and complete stop at those stop signs. Be honest with the officer. If you really didn't see the stop sign or were unaware of the speed limit, let the officer know. Okay. I need to see your uh, license, registration, and proof of insurance, please. My wallet here. Sure. Wait for the officer to ask you for your license or other documents before you reach for them. Washington law requires drivers to show their license, registration, and proof of insurance upon request. Let me grab my registration for you. It's in the glove box. All right. If your documents are out of reach, tell the officer where they are before you reach for them. All right, great. Why don't you sit tight for me? I'll be back in a few minutes, okay? Okay. You as the driver are solely responsible for your car and its occupants. If there are passengers in your car, encourage them to remain quiet and cooperate with the officer's instructions. Avoid becoming argumentative. I promise you that arguing will not change the officer's mind. All right, sir, here's your insurance and your uh, registration back. Okay. Your driver's license. And I've also issued you a citation for failing to stop at the stop sign back there. If you're issued a citation, accepting it or signing it is not an admission of guilt. You will have the opportunity to contest the citation in court. Just make sure you read the back. It tells you how to get it all taken care of, okay? Okay. All right, sir. Good day. Each situation is unique, and police officers must alter their response to fit the circumstances. No matter what those circumstances are, your cooperation is appreciated and important to your safety and the safety of the officer. Just remember, the enforcement of traffic laws helps keep everyone safe.